hi and welcome to another process video this is a 12 by 12 layout I did to complement my last project life layout that I did this is a photo from that same day that I wanted to give its own layout because I love the photo that much I start with some modeling paste and a stencil I'm just gonna do some watercoloring with my distress inks up there over the top of the modeling paste just to give it a nice little bit of a background and some texture I'm using the colours Mermaid Lagoon, Peacock Feathers and Salty Ocean. I'm stamping the colour onto a stamping block and spraying mist on it to give it a bit of a watercolour texture. And then I'm just painting that straight onto my uh, cardstock. I'm misting the cardstock as well just to get the, the, the ink moving a bit. So just coming in with that salty ocean distress ink now, as you can see the modelling paste resists the ink to a degree and it just pops right through that ink and gives it a bit of a texture. I love these colours together, I think they really complement each other and I chose them with my photo because I think it just contrasts the photo really well and just really makes it pop off the background. Now just adding a bit more water to that ink so I can use it to do some splattering with my paintbrush just to give it a bit more interest and a bit more texture really. So while I was drying it I decided that I wanted to just fill in that whole area there so I just filled in that gap with more colour just to make it a complete mat around the photo really. So after mounting the photo on that green pattern paper, I decided I just wanted to make it pop off the background a little bit more, so I decided to double mat it on some white cardstock as well.
and now putting it on the layout. I just think it looks a lot better with that white. It really stands out from that blue background. Now attaching a felt hard embellishment that I have in my stash and very subtly using it to cover up my husband's head and his bright orange shirt that was just in the way. This layout does end up being just very simple and very minimally embellished. I wanted the focus to be on the photo itself and that bright blue background. I do fiddle around with a lot of embellishments just to see what I like and in the end I do just end up going with a, very, with a tag and a few very minimal things. Like I said, lots of fiddling around. In the end, I decide to use my Memento ink and just stamp the date on the tag. And then attach my title with some very basic black thickers. Just finishing off with a few rhinestones and then some splatters with my black marble dilutions just to contrast that blue. And that's the layout, definitely one of my favourites. I hope you liked the video, thanks for watching.